Hello everyone, my name is Jennifer and welcome to Best Kept Plans. Today we're going to be doing a plan with me for the week of December 13th through the 19th, 2021 in my classic HP size planner. If you are interested in seeing that, please stick around. This week I will be using the vertical line layout from Cloth and Paper. I will be pairing it with these Christmas collage circles, winter collage circles, craft page circles, all from Create with Mandy, and these Noel quote stickers from Alicia Michelle XO. I will be pulling in a couple of box stickers, and these are the three washi tapes that I will be incorporating into this week's spread. I really had no idea what I wanted to do when I went into this week's spread, and I was kind of having a hard time trying to figure out where to start, but I decided to do something similar to what I did last week in the sense that I just decided to start with little clusters surrounding the box stickers that I was going to put down and then use that as a jumping off point for where I needed to put more deco and where I wanted to include a larger quote cluster. I pulled this stockings sticker uh, from the Christmas collage circle sheet and I'm going to pair it with one of the craft page circles and this black grid uh, washi tape. I'm putting that all down on Monday because I have a conference for work. Using this uh, stocking sticker actually kind of ended up giving me the inspiration for the color palette I wanted to go with for this uh, spread. I really liked the deep uh, green in that one stocking and so I decided to kind of stick with a green, um, an evergreen coloring for the spread. I'm trying to put down some washi tape, or I'm sorry, some white out to cover up the black washi tape so that you can't see it through the colorful box sticker, and it was not going well. Uh, I have a hard time putting down this type of white out on washi tape. It just doesn't want to stick, but eventually I was able to get it down, and the cluster ended up coming out really nice. Next, I'm going to be putting down a cluster on Friday. The cluster is going to be to indicate a meeting that I have for work. I wanted to use this kind of paint stroke washi tape uh, and I wanted to lay down like a nice long strip of it. I do want this to be a little bit of a larger cluster because I did pull out a um, a sticker that says Frye on it. It's from, uh, according to Allie's little freebie that comes in her order. And I wanted to lay down that as well. So I figured if I created a cluster with three claw circles instead of two, it would give me a little bit of room to um, put down that, that little Frye sticker as well. As you can see, I pulled out um, a sticker with some, uh, a wintergreen tea, a winter green tree uh, and I wanted to pull in a little hint of red as well so I chose this sticker which basically just has two buildings and a bridge between them but there is a red hue on the sticker itself so I figured that would work out well I also decided to incorporate a little bit of this uh, green grid washi tape I love this washi I think it's perfect for Christmassy spreads uh, and since I wanted to kind of have a focus on green in this spread, I figured it was uh, a good one to add in. Once I put down this third little collage circle sticker, I am going to uh, pull out my box sticker, trying to figure out exactly where to layer it. I, I don't know, I, I ended up placing it down here. I do move it a little bit, uh, but I lay down this Friday sticker first. And I put it towards the top of that cluster. I think that's a really good spot for it. And then I ended up laying down this box sticker kind of in between the two layers of washi tape so that you can see a little washi above and below, but that it doesn't block too much of the end of that longer strip of that paintbrush or paint stroke washi. Now that I have those two clusters down, 
I'm done with regards to having to indicate or mark off specific things that I need done or meetings I have for the week. So I kind of have the right hand page of the spread just to play with. And uh, I know I of course want to create a bit of a larger quote cluster. And I'm going to apologize because I didn't realize that I was pretty much completely off camera as I was putting down this cluster at the bottom of the page. I wanted it to span Saturday and Sunday and so you can see here that I am layering down a piece of that black grid washi tape. I have it down on Sunday and I am putting down a page, um, a craft paper page circle and then another of the uh, Christmas collage circles. The Christmas collage circle that I chose is a Christmas tree, so it has those deeper greens in it. But what I realized is that I couldn't layer my quote sticker down on top of that because it would have all been too dark. So I ended up switching my layering and I put down the winter collage circle first, the craft paper circle on top, and then as you can see, I'm layering down this quote sticker from Alicia Michelle XO on top of that craft page circle. It you could still see the quote, quote really well. It just says Noel. It's very simple. Um, and, and so I just left it as that. And then given that that's only one little cluster on the right hand page of the spread, I decided to pull in another um, craft pa paper circle sticker and then a winter collage circle that just has some more evergreen on it. Um, I'm bringing in a little bit of this paint stroke washi as well because I only have that down in one part of the spread so far and then I'm going to lay the layer these um, collage circles on top I am not going to include a quote in this cluster it's just going to be that and after I lay that down I thought I was all done with the spread <laughs> but I ended up putting it on my rings and then realizing that I had not put in um, any washi or dot stickers for my work schedule so I pulled out my avant-garde dot stickers from cloth and paper and I pulled out this uh, green grid washi and I actually ended up deciding to just use green grid washi and the black uh, dot circles for the week. The reason I decided to do that was again because I really wanted um, green to be the predominant color in this week's spread and I had, also, I had only been able to utilize that green washi tape in one cluster and in one small area so I wanted to use more of it on the page and this seemed like a good way to do that. I did kind of change up exactly where I was laying down that washi so that there was a little bit of variation in the heights of where I'm marking off my work schedule but um, it is uniform throughout the week and I'm okay with that. Once I put down my washi and my avant-garde dot sticker on Thursday, I will be done with this week's spread. It is definitely a simple spread. I don't have a ton going on this week, which I think is really good given that it's the week leading up to uh, Christmas. I'm just going to try to uh, get all of my Christmas wrappings done for the holiday. I'm already done with my Christmas shopping, which is great. I hope you enjoyed this plan with me. I am going to move the camera all around here, just trying to get a better angle. For some reason, I thought it was off. Uh, but uh, let me know if you have any comments down below. And as always, everyone, please be safe. Bye-bye.